The London judge who sentenced Jason Nasser described his YouTube channel as vigilantism run amok. For five years, Nasser posted videos as the creeper hunter. He claimed to be exposing men who had messaged him for sex while he pretended to be underage. The 100 episodes of Creeper Hunter TV featured in-person confrontations, full names, and phone numbers. Nasser's tactics in one episode led to criminal charges against him. Earlier this year, he was found guilty of harassment by telecommunications, extortion, and other offenses. Now a Windsor documentary maker is turning his lens on Nasser and the aftermath of Creeper Hunter TV. Nasser got it right once in a while, but he also was careless, I think. There were, there were innocent men who were swept up in his Creeper Hunter TV. That destroys me. <laughs> I mean, it's, there would be nothing worse than somebody uh, pointing a finger at you, uh, 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 calling you a predator or a pedophile. And, and these men had no recourse. Once Nasser pointed his finger and said, you're a predator, you're a pedophile, and posted that video, um, their lives were essentially changed forever. Gallagher has interviewed family members of people who were shown on Creeper Hunter TV. Gallagher says some of those men took their own lives. Nasser will serve 18 months of house arrest, then six months under curfew. The judge said Nasser lacks remorse. But Nasser told CBC News he disagrees. I don't think I'm remorseless. I think I don't have to be public about how I feel about these cases and my own actions. I, I'm not going to talk about what it is that I feel about these people. I feel sorry for them because of the because of the decisions that they made. Because if they were to have made better choices, then they wouldn't have been in that position to be filmed or to meet up with a child that they thought was going to be for a sexual purpose. Nasser plans on appealing the conviction. Gallagher's documentary is still in production with the support of TVO. Dalson Chen, CBC News, Windsor.